Hey guys, today I want to show you how I made this hanging mini storage with a mirror. And these are the items we'll be needing. trying to show you guys a design that I want to make that would flow with the crates now you just take one of the sticks and cut it into the size to join them from behind before spray painting it these are the crates after they've been spray painted these crates you guys are so cool because they have grooves on them that makes it easy for anything to just sit comfortably there that's where i want to place the mirrors on the two crates and i'll be gluing them down with an e6000 glue to make it really firm and sturdy this is the design that i made and it's already spray painted and i want to show you guys where i'd be placing it on the crates I'll be using this board, yes it's a Papa John pizza board or pack, <laughs> spray painting the top then putting it into the crates because you've got these holes there that won't let things sit comfortably there so this is just going to go in there to make it easy for you to put stuffs in there. Perfect fit! I'm using an X-Acto knife to actually cut a trifle board that would connect the two crates together with the mirror. This is what it should look like and I used an A6000 glue to actually glue it to the back for extra support. There is a hook at the back of the mirror to hang it on the wall but then we'll be using these command strips to attach them to the four corners of the board just in case you want to put something heavy there. I don't advise something too heavy but yeah, it's easier that way and convenient. I will be cutting singular strips to put at the top and at the bottom of the two crates and acrylic gems at the four corners of the crates. The turnout is so beautiful you guys and this is when it's on the table and this is when it's hanged on the wall and it's so pretty. I had fun making this project you guys and I have other DIY videos linked in the description box below do check it out and thank you so much for watching and don't forget to click on the subscribe button